Oh boy. You look right here. I went to go pull mullet in the trail. All right, George is taking the filter off. So weird that it would happen on startup after it cooled off. I ran my fingernail across the surface right where it looked like it was oh. Is it seal busted. Oh. It's busted in two places. So that's okay. You know what that means? Whew, that was either a fifty thousand dollar issue <laughs> or five dollars. Or a five dollar issue. All right. Shoo! Hell yeah, brother! You're on the Please Me Fun YouTube channel. Wait up! All right, guys, back at FL2K today. We got some big plans. The El Camino's got a hot tune up in it. Ruby is sitting in the second fastest class right where we wanted her to be. The Blazer is running right on that 950 number, which it needs to run a little bit closer today. I think we went a 956 last night. We're hoping for like a 952 today in qualifying before we send the Blazer down the track for eliminations in the 950 class. Total of two more hits today for all the cars the rest of the day. And Jackson brought the Nova back. 240 was done. So James has a Nova. We're gonna turn Ruby up a little bit faster, trying to go like an 8-2, because that's where the class has moved to. The El Camino started leaking oil like crazy last night. The oil filter seal blue. So we got an oil filter and we're gonna try that out. Hopefully we don't have a leak. Check this out, brother. Okay, okay. You were floored the whole run. Look at how aggressive. The timing's so aggressive right here. See how the RPM almost can't even rise. Yeah, dude, like the engine can't even accelerate. So <laughs> this moment right here is where it picks up the tire and drops it back on the ground. So I think Make we sure. go from that moment, from when the tire touches the ground, we just add in three degrees of timing from there on. And that should, maybe even two degrees of timing. Yeah. That'll go from a, whatever, 956 maybe right down to that 950 mark we could go on the shy side of it and make sure you get a run because if you go at 949 it doesn't count at all right so like we have two runs today we might as well take the more conservative side yeah for show sure. like a degree and a half because the timing ramp is insane like this is this is by far the most timing i've ever pulled out of a vehicle <laughs> <laughs> 19 degrees so the tire is replanted by here, so we can just make this like more of a... Yeah, give it a little more juice. And then when you run the streetcar class, because you're also entering that, <laughs> we could just, once it puts the tire down, just put it all back in it. Yep. But we could also put the big pulley, or the smaller pulley back on. Right. So. Go up, go we have some decisions to make. So we have 950 qualifying here in a bit and then George is in streetcar now too so Blazers double entered <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna try and win the slow class and the streetcar class as well so we got a lot of work to do today well you guys know it's the morning before some racing so we gotta do a two-step check Place. I literally just said the same exact thing. It's a good place to be. We got so it. I can drive it, but yeah. yeah. All right. We need that nine. 
50. That's all we need. Alright, first round of the day, spicy tuna and mullet! Alright, here goes Cleaner up here in mullet. Hopefully the fastest rip yet! I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I don't know if the lockup worked. I didn't feel the lockup come on. I honestly couldn't tell it was going so freaking fast. Oh my god, that was a 7 0. I'm putting the car on eBay for $10 tonight. Hey, 693. Woohoo! 10, baby. That's perfect. What a great couple of passes. Q1, dude, let's go. First qualifier of the day, we got exactly what we wanted for Ruby, almost what we wanted for the Blazer, and exactly what we wanted for this. So, love that. I'm thinking about buying an Xfinity 28 tech card. Double enter that dog. Get a double enter. Otherwise, we'd only have one other qualifier, but Extreme 28 is not for like another hour, so I get another tech card, we could make three more hits today. If we're feeling spicy. I don't think I'm going to make one in Extreme 28. Yeah. yeah. I might do it just for fun. Yeah. What do you think about that slow 330? Was that 313? We've been at 3.08. What are we going with the LS in the 8? 455? 458, I think. 457. Yeah, so if we did that, I mean, it would be 680 just if we can get it back to there. Yeah, we got plenty of back half. Yeah. Just, oh, yeah. 210, boy. 2260 foot, I think we went. Well, 117, 116 when we had the LS. Yeah, so the 122, 60, but it's slow, but it worked in the heat yeah, of the day the heat, today. For that, in the heat, good. When it the track tightens up later on when the sun goes down. Let's go. Let's go. Spice it. Blazer. Street car qualifier. Pulling up, going for faster than a 950. But we did not change the pulley, so it's still pretty low boost, like 12 feet at night. are looking real good. Yeah. That 
dude, he got the tree on that one. Yeah, he did. He, he did. did. 084. It was literally tree. perfect. Yes. About time he did something. That's so, all. That amount of wheelie is perfect. That amount of wheelie is money. We, we might need to put the other pulley on it, give it some boost for the streetcar class. So. Yeah, but then it's gonna mess up the other one. Yeah, but we'll switch it back. Just six that, bolts. That's on you. <laughs> I think. Let's go, baby. But that wheelie, that was like Clean. perfect. What was the 60 foot? 132. Dude, that's dude. gotta be up there with the fastest ever, right? We're gonna be going fast. It's so clean, dude. Hey, we're good. So we need to leave it like this though for the next round of the 950 class. And then before the streetcar class, you'll have to swap your pulley. Cause look, you're gonna be racing these guys going 9 0s. Look at the tree, 084. Way out ahead of him, That's dude. what I'm talking about. <laughs> hey, I gotta tell you guys something. I hit the scales on the way dude, back. Oh, yeah? With myself in it, 35-25. Hey, about the same as Mullet. <laughs> That's nice. Guys, we got a little problem here on Mullet's tune-up. See this green line? That's the oil pressure. Making like 90 through here, and then it tanks, so. We just did that oil change. It might just need a quart or two to fix that. So dude, we only pulled 2.05 Gs. And we've been what, 2.25? Somewhere around there, yeah. So she wasn't even pulling as hard as she has before. Right, with that LS deal, we were getting after the short track a lot harder though. Yeah. So now we just work on this because we have the back half there. We, we got the back half, 210. Yeah, we need to get a little bit in the 60 foot. Yeah, we're good down. And then after 60, get after between the 60 and the 330. That's where it's gonna get faster. All right, all right. So guys, we're gonna turn on the actual full lock of the converter. The soft lock was on, but it didn't make a huge difference. We're putting on, it's got two different type of lockups. We're putting on the full lock this time. It should be spicy. You should hear it sound like another shift in the car. Like, ah, like it's got another fourth gear. So, like it's got a fourth gear. We'll see what happens. It's got some fresh spark plugs. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. Uh, Nate, read this tune. What you got from Pete? Big spicy. <laughs> so I like to see. Should we open it? <laughs> That's what open I like it? to see. <laughs> Spicier than one. It's a little spicy. Just on this area here. Yeah. See if she holds, brother. That's funny. Nate made a tune up and it almost matches Pete's exactly. So we're on the same page. Suspension wise, you think we're good? I think it'll take it, yeah. Alright. Okay guys, we added one degree back to the blazer to try and get that 950 instead of that 948 for the 950 class. Right when George gets back, we're gonna pull this big pulley off, put the semi smaller one on that you went a 9-1 with earlier. All right? Or even smaller. Class is getting, you know, faster, yeah. so we got to go fast. And then he's going to go up for streetcar right after and try and make a good lick. Because right now he's not even in the slow class. He's a little too slow for the slow class. So we really need to be on like an 890. We'll get there. We can get Figure there. it out. All right, so this was the pulley we had on it when we went to 9-1. We got a little bit smaller. That should be good. Yeah. So it'll be a one-to-one -one ratio. It's going to be good. I don't know, man. There is a 43 tooth there, though. I know. I was. <laughs> I didn't want to get in trouble, but you know, I was going to open that box. Let me see how big this is. <laughs> All right, we got the big spicy tune up in it, and we are in the lanes. I actually entered Mullet into the Extreme 28 class, which has some like 670 cars in it. But I was like, hey, we can get more runs today versus just a normal two qualifier. So we're double entered. So this will be our first qualifier in extreme 28 so technically we can make this and then two more runs today if we wanted to one more in street car and one more qualifier in extreme 28 so the track's good man i want to take advantage of it so we're just gonna run the wheels off of this thing that six just got me so fired up i was like i gotta run this thing some more all right mullet
All right, guys, so since that was an extreme 28 qualifier, we're going to tow the car back. Street car, you're supposed to drive back. But since that was an extreme 28 run, we're going to tow it back so we can read the spark plugs. Make sure our timing is good, but that felt solid. Can't wait to see what that was. That was the same boost up top, but it felt strong down low. Let's go! Dude, 682. Oh! <laughs> 213. 213. Hogan. <laughs> we doing a four-car shootout. Dude, 682. Let's go. Literally a whole 10. Heat of the day. Wait till Nate tonight. Nate and I were talking. We're like, dude, it's pretty hot. Like, this thing's. This might be too much on a 275. What did you that put the boost at insane. on the top there? Same, Still 38 same boost. That was just the lockup turned on, dude. Dude, and the lockup's like, Argh! like it just is like pulling the steering wheel out of Warp my hands. Speed. Dude, we might <laughs> be doing low 70s tonight. Oh, I want. We got to go 70 tonight. Oh. Off the day. Yeah. I mean, come on, let's go back, dude. So road. much headway oh, in man. one day. Woo! <laughs> Shoot, brother, 118, 60 foot, 305 to the 313. I want that two in the 330 so bad. 305 to the 330, 452 at 168 in the eighth, 682, 213. Boy, woo! Look at how the lockup is like a third shift, bro. Here. You could hear it from the starting line. Oh, I could hear it and feel it in the oh, car. Sure. It was warp speed. So sick, and then look how linear it is. <laughs> it's insane. Real good I think we locked it up at a really good spot. Yeah. Also. Like now we can work off of that and maybe start locking it earlier. Say so gear, boy. First gear. First gear, yeah, right after the burnout. Right, 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 right off the train. Right after the, the burnout. Right on the train. What do you mean? That's freaking <laughs> sick. A bunch of guys have ran like 680s and 670s, so they just put up a couple thousand dollars and they're having a shootout tonight. So we're going to abandon our last qualifiers and just run this shootout against. The stick car that went 675, Rick who went 672, and one other car that went like a 685. Which, so honestly, that tune right there in the nice air that we're gonna get tonight should go 70s all day. 70s, yeah. yeah you'll probably go that 40s. Let's put a 69 tune up in it. 669. Okay, right. I like it. What we got here? This is eight is six. You know, problem child's right here, but it looks good. This is our normal problem child. Yeah, looks good. The strap's still on it. That's always a good sign. <laughs> James likes the straps off it by the end of the run. <laughs> <laughs> no, look at the really it's kind of weird. Weird. It's, kind of weird. it's not, this is the cadmium starting to burn off. That's why yeah. it looks like that. This one has a burnt off, mm -hmm. and now it's starting to burn off. So these might actually be a little cold. So we're good? Yeah. Hey man, those gloves just went a 682. <laughs> those are some fast gloves. Just so you know. <laughs> Keep an eye on them. All right, guys, if my semi amateur trailer park tuning is correct, this will be a 951. Good. 
I'm pretty sure. I'm elite. pretty sure you're number one qualifier right now. <laughs> but uh, now you gotta switch your pulley for the street car qualifier. Yep, that'll that's be later. Tonight, so yeah, you got a while. Got yeah. yeah. All right, come on, Jackson. Golly, this boy about to boot scoot and boogie on down here. Oh man, that thing's shining like a diamond. First off, that was 11 pounds on a brake and it took it. And it was a book in it. And then it went king and stripped all the bolts that hold the rear end to the leaf springs. And then the car tried to drive over the rear end. So what it did, it bounced, oh bounced, bounced, and then God. locked the tires up. Is the rear end damaged? The quarter panels are cooked. But. Oh my God. Well, hey, at least you didn't nose it into that yeah, guy or I didn't the wall. hit the guy next to me. You did what you had to do. Yeah. So. Man, you're good at breaking race cars. Dude, I am on a roll this weekend. <laughs> Got our body Two race cars. Hey, dude, Ruby. <laughs> I don't think she oh, knows we, you. That's, sure. that's already been tested. We can, I can't break down. <laughs> she one. knows Just you. Just keep the laptop away. That's all we gotta you do. See them ten foot flames coming out of that pipe? Eleven pounds of boost and it went. Dude, it was sick. Just bill, bill. Why is it surging on the two step? Just. I told him it was, and he wouldn't let me fix it. Ah, uh, it was. Uh, uh, uh. I wanted the flames. It's all right, dude. It was a grudge race. I had to have the intimidation. Go or blow, dude. Go or blow. <laughs> well, we got a grudge race now. Yeah. We're doing a four car shootout. So I guess let's go up there. All right, so we got Grub Worm facing off against Old Clear Rick Skinner. Philo taking on the Green Mamba. All right, well, we're hey, we, got, uh, uh, we got Jonathan Atkins, fastest stick car in the world, 675. Good luck, Worm. Appreciate it, man. FLT Capers, 8-5 Ryan Crowder. Dude's a beast. Let's get it, dude. Yeah, Grub Worm, bro. Leroy been, Leroy's been hiding from that car for years. <laughs> Bullet got caught. <laughs> Let's go see if we can tear him up. My big brother go get him. Yeah, come on. Okay, guys, we're racing the fastest stick car on the planet. He's been at 675. He, that was his last pass, and we got him in the shootout. First rip, so let's go. It'll be fun regardless. But we got Mullet wicked up, boy. This could get rowdy. See if we can take that thing down, boy. That thing's fast. Having up, boys. I haven't heads up race in a while. 
Can you blame me? How much that red light by? Not point much. oh one four. <laughs> six sixty six. What? Is this mine? Six That's six you. seven. Bro, six sixty six. A four thirty nine in the eighth at a hundred and seventy two. What? <laughs> That's a big win for McFarland Racing, dude. Three sixes in a row today, and a 666 at 212. That's a personal best, dude. Dude, three sixes in one day. Six second car now. Yeah, it was crazy. Yeah, I had a six second car before. It's a six second car now, dude. Fire me off, you guys. 172 with you. Yeah. It didn't even feel that fast. The car feels 439. The car's just like, Rrr. I'm like, all right, that's it. <laughs> like, it feels so good. The car is dialed, you guys. Let's go. All right, well, because I read lit, we're done racing for the night, but the Blazers got one more hit to do. Oh, I'm gonna sleep tonight. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna sleep tonight. This is. I've been waiting for this day when this thing. I've never seen so many people so excited to see you lose a race. Ever. <laughs> All right. Hey, as long as they gotta see that PB, dude, that makes me happy. Can we get a hand check real quick? Check slip. Dude. All right, I might be shaking a little bit. <laughs> Let's check the slip though. Look at that, 296, 115 and 60 foot. Still not crazy. 439, 172. Whew. All right, guys, so George and the Blazer are pulling up, and he's doing his last street car qualifier of the day. So no 950 index to worry about. He's just trying to go like a bottom nine or an 890. I don't know if it'll do it. But we'll see. All right, all right. Some of the finest Brother. driving. That's some of the finest driving you've ever done. <laughs> it was like brop, 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 perfectly yeah, yeah. set it back down. Bro, so I Why'd you let the out? car Somehow or another, it was just in third before it was supposed to be. So either I slammed it in on accident oh. or something like that. Okay. Because it's like, it's like, at, it's time to shift. What did they like, run to the eighth? Nine, five seventy. Bro, that was an eight, dude. <laughs> yeah. 
So I wonder Big if you're still time. qualified or not. I'm already in it. Okay, so you are qualified yeah, yeah, for good. street car. All right. Whew. We're good, baby. We're going dude, fast tomorrow. 570? Yes, Let's sir. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> really like it, dude. Hey, good job driving, setting it down. Yeah, that was I'll good. try and control that, though, with the tuna. We'll just do a couple little tickles. Yeah. So hopefully you don't have to freaking I try and tackle. I pedaled it once, but she tried the thing. Yeah. Go back up on me again. Hey, hell of a day, boys. Hell of a yeah, day. Well, it's six yeah. seconds back to back to back. Aside from Jack Stan's uh, rear end That's situation, we had a freaking heck of a day. Jack Stan, it was a good weekend. Hey, Ruby did good. Ruby's good. So, James, yeah. we're all in the race tomorrow, which is insane. Really proud of the team. Really excited for tomorrow. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. New for Dale. We'll freaking see you later.